A croquembouche or croque and bouche is a French dessert consisting of choux pastry balls piled into a cone and bound with threads of caramel. In Italy and France, it is often served at weddings, baptisms and first communions. Name The name comes from the French phrase croque en bouche, meaning something that crunches in the mouth. Presentation A croquembouche is composed of profiteroles piled into a cone and bound with spun sugar. It may also be decorated with other confectionery such as sugared almonds, chocolate, and edible flowers. Sometimes it is covered in macarons or ganache. History The invention of the croquembouche is often attributed to Antonin Kerm, who includes it in his 1815 cookbook Le Pâtissier Royal Parisien, but it is mentioned as early as 1806, in André Viard's Culinary Encyclopédia Le Cuisinier Imperial, and in Antoine Beauvillier's 1815 Le Art du Cuisinier. In Viard's Encyclopédia and other early texts e Grimaud de la Rainière's Neophysiologie du Gout, it is included in lists of entremets. Elaborate dishes, both savory and sweet, that were served between courses during large banquets. In popular culture On March 6, 2009, alumni of the Pune based Maharashtra State Institute of Hotel Management and Catering Technology entered the Limca Book of Records after creating India's biggest croquembouche. It was recorded as 15 feet meters tall. Croquembouche was one of the spoiled desserts which Gloria Munson serves to the WJM News team and program director in A New Sue Ann, the season 5 episode of The Mary Tyler Moore Show. In a takeoff on All About Eve, Sue Ann's show is hijacked by Gloria Linda Kelsey, who prepares a segment on French pastry. Sue Ann lets Gloria make the mistake of using unrefrigerated cream. On 8 June 2009, Season 1 Episode 37, Fifth Pressure Test Elimination of MasterChef Australia Series 1, four out of eleven contestants baked a croquembouche made by Adriano Zumbo in 2 hours and 15 minutes. This challenge was repeated in the following seasons of the series. On 1 September 2014, Season 5, Episode 15 of the reality TV competition MasterChef, three out of the final six contestants baked an entire croquembouche in 90 minutes for their pressure test. In the November 15, 2015 episode of Last Week Tonight, aired days after the 2015 terrorist attacks in Paris, host John Oliver, in a celebration of French culture, referred to the croquembouche as a French Freedom Tower. On October 21, 2017, Dwayne Johnson tweeted that his wrestling persona, The Rock, whose tagline was, "'Can you smell what The Rock is cooking?' specializes in "'moist croquembouche'. On 31 August 2018, Two Point Studios released Two Point Hospital, the spiritual sequel to Bullfrog Productions' theme hospital. The final level of which acts as a sandbox level and the hospital is called croquembouche. See also <laughs>